Okay, so today I'm going to show you how to play um, Dirty Magic by The Offspring, the acoustic version, which is on the Greatest Hits CD, on the one with the DVD inside it. It's a very old song from them, and nearly nobody knows it, unless they're really The Offspring fans, but it's a really cool song, so if you listen to it, you should better listen to the acoustic version. I like it better, but you can also listen to the other one, but I prefer the acoustic one, so... It's really easy, it's with power chords and it's a good thing for beginners always to start up with and it got a cool intro and everything, so here we go guys. Okay, so to start up, we put our fingers on a two-fingered power chord on the third fret of the low E string and on the fifth fret of the A string. Now, this fifth fret isn't required for the first thing we do, but since we're going to play nearly the whole riff in power chords, we'll just pl place it there so it's easier to play the whole thing. Now, we're going to slide up from the third fret of low E string to the fifth fret, so it sounds like... And with the power chord, it looks like... So this is your first position to play with pattern. So we play again. E E A E E A E. Now we slide this whole thing down to the eighth fret on the low E string and the tenth fret on the A string, and we play. Two times the low E string and one time the A string. Then we slide this thing up to the 7th fret on the low E string and the 9th fret on the A string and we play E E E A E. Then we so if we put this all together it will sound like Now there's the last bit missing, which we play on null on the low E string and 2 and 3 on the A string. So it's going to sound like... So what we do is we play null, 2, null, 3, 2. So again... And if you put it all together, you get... And that's it for the intro. The chorus is very easy too, it's like in most Offspring songs you only use power chords. Now we're going to have a power chord on the 7th fret on the A string and the others on the 5th fret. And we're going to slide this down to the... Fuck. Okay, so to play the chorus is very easy too. Like in most Offspring songs, it's only composed by power chords. So our first power chord is going to be on the 5th fret on the A string and on the D and the G string on the 7th fret. We're going to slide this power chord over to the 7th and 9th fret, like this. So it's going to sound like... Okay, again. And then you strum this, like, um... Uh, 
Okay, so to play the chorus is very easy too. Like in most Offspring songs, we only use power chords for it. Um, so we go from the fifth fret on the A string and the, and the seventh fret on the G and B. Fuck. Okay, so to play the chorus is very easy too. Like in most offspring songs, we only use power chords. So our first power chord is going to be on the 5th fret on the A string and on the 7th fret on the D and the G string. We're going to slide this power chord down to the 7th and 9th fret. So it's going to sound like... Okay, again. So after this, we strum this 7th and 9th fret power chord, 3 fingered power chord, 4 times. So together, we do this part 2 times, so it's going to sound like... Now we go up to the 3rd fret of the low E string and the 5th fret on the A and D string. And we play again. So we push this five times. One, two, three, five. Then we go to our first power chord again and play it like the one before. So we do. So what we got when we put this all together, we get. And that's it for the chorus. So I hope this video was helpful to you guys. Uh, I hope you learned something out of it. It's a cool song. And just always practice, practice, practice and you will get there. So rock on guys.